Hi Leo, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and it's time for your love bite. Let's see Leo, what's going on with your love life? What's the message that wants to show through for you today? And uh, please remember, these are general collective readings, will not resonate with all of you. Take what works for you, okay? Leave the rest. And welcome back all my subscribers, welcome in newbies we welcome you if you enjoy the reading do subscribe to the channel become part of us all right leo the cards i have on the table right now for you are the king of cups the world four of pentacles eight of pentac eight of cups sorry nine of swords the sun page of cups seven of pentacles and the moon card all right some situation which uh, maybe involves marriage or a long-term uh, commitment hierophant is right here but under my deck right so from general overview that i see of these nine cards on the table leo it shows me that somebody is very stressed out about something some relationship here not being able to sleep sleep at night overthinking maybe somebody walked away from this connection and things are still hidden in the dark um we'll clarify these cards let's see what's happening here leo let's take some uh, angel blessing cards sorry uh, dialogue message cards first uh, let's see what if you guys could say something to each other what that would be and then we'll start the reading so my angel spirits if yeah okay they're listening leo and their person spirit leo and their person if they could say something to each other now one more okay and let's take a couple from here as well leo and their person spirit All right, Leo, let's begin our reading. The first card here says, I am under so much stress. Didn't I just say that? This was the center uh, of the spread. Somebody is really under a lot of stress regarding this connection or relationship. I haven't apologized because I don't feel deserving of your forgiveness. I haven't been able to forgive myself for how I treated you. My heart breaks a little bit more every day that we are apart. Like I said, somebody could have walked away from this connection and the other person is now saying, hey, I haven't apologized because I can't even forgive myself. Somebody behaved, behaved very badly with the other person. I hate that your rejection can still trigger a can still trigger a tendency for me to spiral out of control with unhealthy and addictive behaviors. I always felt your loving energy so strongly as a comforting presence. It hurts me when I can't feel your energy. Are you pulling away from me? I'm healing from deep trauma after losing you in the physical world. On reflection, I realized my inability to put myself first let me down, but then as you're my mirror, I feel I ultimately let you down. I'm so sorry I couldn't be there for you when you needed me the most. I didn't know how to make myself a priority and in not doing so, I lost the biggest part of me, you. Every night I just want to be home and home is in your arms. It really hurt me to have to keep my distance but I just can't give you what you deserve at this time. I enjoy your company but don't want a commitment. All right, uh, Leo, let's see what's going on here. Uh, King of Cups with the world in reverse, which probably means uh, somebody that is having a little bit of difficulty in shutting down a chapter with their person. Maybe their partners walked away, but they're still kind of 
having a little difficulty in letting go. Uh, King of Cups spirit. Yes. And the world. This King of Cups has a lot of love. They know that this is my soulmate, twin flame, past life uh, connection, spiritual bond. They have a lot of love for their person and they are not they are not happy to have to shut this chapter down and lose their partner. Uh, even though maybe in, in the past they never really showed or they had difficulty in you know showing their emotions, but they do they do love. They do love their person. They feel that they don't want to if this is a divorce case, they don't want to divorce them. They feel that will be injustice to this connection. They don't want to lose their marriage if this is a marriage. They, they, they want to keep this the way it was. They feel secure in the knowledge that you know their partner is still with them. So they don't want this to go wrong. They don't want their partner to release them completely because they feel that this is a relation. You know, this, this, should, this should stay. Yeah, they want their partner to return, in fact. They, they don't want the partner to release them, they want them to return because in the past I think uh, somebody has walked away which has led to a lot of stress and anxiety for this person. Okay, Eight of Cups and uh, the Nine of Swords Spirit. And the Nine of Swords. Somebody's walked away from a partnership because maybe their partner was always uh, maybe busy in their own life or somebody here made a decision. Things just came out in the open regarding something. Maybe somebody was very busy all the time, uh, you know, juggling multiple things and not spending enough time or whatever happened here. Leo, I don't want to get into that, but yes. Somebody walked away which has led to the other person now feeling all this stress and anxiety and um, they are, they feel that this entire thing has backfired on them now. Uh, there's no happiness, there's no sunshine, they're very very restless now because of this whatever conflict or fight that's happened between the two of you, uh, Leo. Uh, so Leo, this could be you, but this could be a cross watcher, I don't know, but I do see somebody now wants to offer some kind of apology or sorry, uh, they're looking at uh, their, their life and saying so much time and effort has been put in this connection and uh, it's all gone to waste, nothing really, you know, grew from that. Uh, Page of Cup Spirit. Yes, they want to go and apologize to their person and tell their person, hey, you make me very, very happy. You are my sunshine. And can we just drop this burden now? Can we stop, you know, carrying all the weight of the world on our shoulders of whatever has happened in the past? Let's just put this down and try and be try and find happiness once again. They, I think, imploring to their partner to say, hey, we've already sown seven of these pentacles, right? I mean, let's just wait for the harvest. The best is yet to come kind of a thing. And uh, let's see, uh, seven of pentacles, seven of pentacles. Yes, they want their partner to kind of, you know, say, hey, let's just get, stop, you know, uh, being on guard with me, why don't you just give up the fight now? Instead of releasing me, why don't you just release this? Whatever bad memories have now been created in the past, can you just let that go instead? So this is what the person wants to say. But then I have the moon card here. So what's this moon card here? Just going to do this again. Very important card. Spirit, what's this moon card here for uh, Leo? What's this moon card? Okay. And one more. I don't think their partner is going to believe them right away. Leo, yes, that's what I was thinking. That's why I had to clarify it completely. I don't think their partner, whoever's apologizing, 
not them, their partner, right? I don't think they really trust their partner as they would want them to. Uh, this person has their sword up now. This person has become wiser, more intelligent, is now going to ask the right questions. They still remember everything. <laughs> they haven't forgotten anything. They, I don't think this person has that drive or passion even to um, now make any forward movement with somebody who they consider to be the king of swords in reverse. Now this is equal pair, right? But a king of swords in reverse is somebody who doesn't speak the truth. So they feel, you know, you keep too many secrets from me. You've always kept secrets from me. How do I trust you uh, seeing your past record? And uh, I've already let go of this. I'm not stressed about this anymore and according to me this is already ended so I don't think somebody is going to open up so much in a hurry with one sorry because the trust is lost now with all the bad memories now I'll still clarify the hierophant maybe something good will come out of this spirit what's this hierophant here for Leo Hierophant. As of now, Leo, uh, whoever the feminine here is, doesn't uh, <clears throat> kind of made a choice here. They are more concentrating on the wrong that's happened in this connection. They don't really trust uh, their partner. So they are kind of making a decision and a choice not to give it any energy at the moment. Keeping silent and uh, that's it. Yeah, not planning to return immediately from what I see. So that's all I have for you, Leo. Uh, till next time then, love and light. Take care. Namaste.